the 30th day of January, and also our last day of praying and fasting. Now, I don't know what you were fasting from, but I was fasting from sugar, and I'm going to kill my associate in love. He started this whole thing out. His first session was with Krispy Kreme donuts. Ladies and gentlemen, I could eat a whole dozen hot now, right now. In fact, I can't wait. That's where I'm going. My first thing after this fast is going to be to get me a hot now donut. But I know you've enjoyed this. I've enjoyed it. Oh, it's, it's always a time for me to get closer to God as we start the new year out. And I know God's already been doing some great things in your life. I know He has. I know He has mine. I know He has. He always does in January when I take this, this 21 days and I fast and I, I, I keep myself just, I'm talking about locked in, just like you're with a rifle, you lock in those sights. I'm locked in because I'm praying more. I'm I'm denying the flesh of things that I crave and just honoring God. And you know, we've been looking at, and I've tried to teach you exactly how I pray and how to step into your prayer closet and have a system to pray. And I've used the word facts, and I've used that for years. And some people use the acrostic prayer, but I like facts. And we've been saying, if we're going to watch God move in 21 in a big way, and He is a big way, I promise. we got to have letter F, faith. Letter A, we got to just adore Him, worship Him, adoration. C, confession. Hey, got to get rid of the sin in our lives. We saw that. And then T, thanksgiving, thank Him. Hey, for the past, thank Him for what He's doing now, and thank Him for what He's going to do. And the last letter in facts is supplication. There's room to tell God what you need. It really is. He says in Philippians 4.19, My God shall supply all your needs according to His riches and glory through Christ Jesus. And here's a great exhortation from Jesus in Matthew 7, 7 and 8. He says, Hey, all that seek me shall find me. He says, If you knock on the door, I'll open the door. He who seeks me, he who knocks, will find me. So let me encourage you. Go to God. Tell Him your heart. Tell Him what's on your mind. Tell Him what you need. Because He's promised He'll meet your needs. Now watch this. He will not promise you to meet your wants. But He has promised you to meet your needs. So as you close your prayer each and every day, tell Him what you need. Now here's what I do. I pray for the needs of all my family, my church, all my friends, all my relatives. That's the way I do it, and you can do it too. So, supplications. It's been a great 21 days of praying and fasting. I love you. I'm glad you're part of our body, and I thank God for you every day. And remember, Jesus is awesome.